Hello, dear travelers. How are you today? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking. Uh, this is your spicy, dearest, humble Uncle Carl here with another exciting review. Now, as you well know, ooh, another light burnt out. That, this looks terrible, actually. This lighting's really bad. I'm gonna have to go to my, like it, three of these lights have gone out, you know? I mean, in the past week, it's ridiculous. And I just don't understand it. It confuses me and it baffles me. But as you know, the show must go on. Today I was able to do Subway. I got a $5 foot long. I'll tell you what I get on my $5 foot long. Um, and my sandwich artist, I believe his name was Jose, did an excellent job. I get a uh, foot long. This is kind of what I eat, you know, on lunch. You know, I try to eat healthy during the day so I can do ridiculously unhealthy food items at night uh, and bring you what you expect and what you deserve. So tonight, um, I, this is this is kind of what I usually get. And you know what, Subway's unremarkable. Um, it's there's nothing special about it. But what I usually get is ham and turkey on wheat, with pepper jack cheese, um, lettuce, some onions, uh, bell pepper, salt pepper, oil and vinegar. It's a pretty decently healthy sandwich, you know, nothing spectacular. But it's a $5 foot long, it's genuine Annie. And weather permitted me today to go ahead and uh, do this, so. Ooh, this smells and reeks of onions. I like onions, but I mean, this just kind of, they put, Jose put quite a bit on there. And you probably can't see anything. I mean, this is just really bad lighting, but I'm just, I'm going to have to put this up regardless. I'm going to go ahead and take a bite here. Hmm. Now, one thing in regards to like meat quality, Subway's meats and like ham and turkey aren't spectacular. I'm not terribly impressed with them. You know. Um, their veggie quality is usually very, very good. And the good thing about Subway is the customization. No one person gets the exact same sandwich. I mean, maybe some people do, but in general, you know, everybody gets their, their own kind of spice, their own little flavor to it, if you will. And so that, that's kind of a good thing about Subway. But overall, is Subway like spectacular quality? No. Um, the, the kind of thing about it is that customization. You get it your way. You know, you get Subway your way. Um, this here cost uh, five twenty-eight after tax, um, and it was—it's a pretty good meal. You know, it's—I um, like this for lunch a lot of times. Um, not recently, but but I do get it. You know, maybe once a month or something, maybe twice a month. And uh, so it's something I'm familiar with. And one thing about Subway is, is their bread selection. Again, Subway's all about variety. You can get whatever you want, whatever way you like it. You know, you have the base and then you build off of that, which is really, really nice. You know, it's very nice, unlike the lighting in this video. You can't even see my tie or probably my belt. Uh, you can't see anything. And that's terrible. You deserve better. So I'm going to go and pledge to you the viewer, the humble blue collar worker that I'm targeting um, to get some more lights and maybe brighter ones, maybe a new camera, maybe a tripod. Who knows? Your uncle's crazy, spicily and crazy. Actually, that, that last sequence of words did not make much sense. Uh, I thought I had something there, but it didn't work out. So anyway, what am I going to rate this? I think that because I've had it before, I'm going to be a little bit biased. I go back to Subway because it is a healthier alternative than most lunch options. 
I'm gonna probably rate this, however, a, um, you know, I think it gets a six, just because of the ways you can get it, you know, and, um, how you can prepare your own sub. I think it gets and deserves a, um, 6.16, and that's what I'm going to give it, and, um, again, I apologize about the lighting. My producer's gonna be have his, my producer's so, I'm afraid to put this up because of what he might do to me. And my writer as well. My writer had a, I've just miffed his lines and I've, I've, I've really disappointed my producer. Everybody involved in this great, huge production that we call Spicy Carl Assessment, you know, is, you know, all 17 workers on staff is just, um, I'm letting him down right now. So, um, anyway, God bless. We'll see you again. And, uh, Thanks for watching.